will read it as a normal level of signal, ionic system. This system has been formulated with the latest studies related to ionic and magnetic fields emitted from minerals, voids, and underground bodies. The ionic system relies on the detection of ionic and magnetic fields in the user's surroundings, distances of up to 120 meters. Using the ionic system. To start this system, first, we install the sensor for the ionic system in the bag of the device which bears the name Ionic Sensor. Second, we operate the unit for the ion system. We will be shown the ionic system screen, waiting for the choice of operating system. Third, we select the ionic system from the main unit and press the OK button. We will see a connection screen appear in the main unit. The ion system unit moves to the ionic system screen. When using this system, we move the unit of the ion system up and down slowly or up and down at the same speed, keeping the device slightly lower towards the ground. In this case, a closed signal will appear on the indicator in the unit of the ion system. The indicator increases as the signal strength increases or as we get closer to the target in conjunction with a gradual acoustic alert that increases as the signal strength increases. The cursor moves to the right in case of metals and the indicator appears in a yellowish red color and the cursor moves to the left in case of spaces and appears in blue. To check the validity of the signal, we do a reset by pressing the mode button once, but in a different direction to the point from which the signal was first picked up. This step is repeated more than once if the signal continues to appear, which means that the signal is completely correct. Warning: The reset should not be done at the point where the signal was issued because we will lose the signal and the device will read it as a normal level of signal. By